Samsung. So this is Android based. Uh, the other couple of things Matt talked about, which is quite unique and different, obviously there's no physical EPP on this device here. You asked about touchscreen earlier, so from here I can't see the screen, so it has a privacy filter. Again, if I stand in front of it, it's quite well protected from, um, from any shoulder surface. So if we do a transaction, Okay, again, so all the screens here are uh, based on HTML5, um, and this is very similar to the application we're using at Cartronics. We do multiple languages. Here you can see the encrypted touchscreen or the EPP. Um, we'll select cash and draw transaction from my credit account as an example. Select $20 and then enter. And I'm now presented with an option for the receipt. Do I want to SMS or receipt to my phone, email, or display? Uh, I'll take a moment to display here. Again, I can take an image of that with my phone if I don't like it. Um, now, what's happening here is, as we discussed earlier, the system is now taking an image of who's standing in front of the device. It will also take an image of the cash being presented and also the cash being withdrawn. Now that's very important for dispute resolution if there's a suggestion of, say, transaction reversal fraud, or if the customer wants to you know, dispute the transaction, then you know, we can pull those images up to the server and uh, correlate um, those, those uh, different images. Again, you can see we've got the transaction detail on the screen. So if I wanted, I could take a snapshot with my mobile phone, or again, I would send SMS based to me directly. The demo we're using here is, is a live demo. So what I mean by that is all the information from here, from the client, is being passed to our enterprise server, which is in Canada. So it's going quite a long way, so we're passing data over the network, pretty much as would happen in the real world. So it's pretty very reflective of the way the system would operate. Um, what else? I think you may have noticed is when I took the cash, the shutter moved up over the uh, card reader here. So if a criminal had attached a skimming device, and then when that shutter moves up, it's going to bang up against it, and therefore provide an extra layer of physical protection against uh, fraudulent activity. Uh, inside, again, you can see very little in the top box. We've managed to take away many of the traditional components. So large PC core, hard disk, RAM, cooling fans, all that stuff's taken away, which helps keep the running cost down. And then from here down, we've got our existing four high bunch dispenser, so it's proven, reliable, high volume capability. Uh, biometric scanner there for that additional layer of authentication if you needed it. Uh, what we may find is that for large volume cash withdrawals, potentially used as a second layer of authentication, or indeed if the bank chooses to use that potentially as a primary uh, authentication method. But it's all about giving a little bit of flexibility uh, for our customers and for their consumers. So it's a very quick overview of the, the hardware. Um, One other thing to your question.